watching Let's Chat. Well, if you love art, you do not want to miss this interview because coming up this weekend is the Plum Nelly Depot Art Show. I'm so excited to have with me Sandy White and William Back. Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks so tell us. me about the Plum Nelly Depot Art Show. When, where, how much is it, all the things? Um, it is this weekend, Saturday. Um, from 10 to 4.30 at our high school gym, the uh, Dade County High School, um, which is on 300 uh, Tradition Lane in Trenton. Um, and it's going to be a wonderful day. Um, have almost 50 artists. Um, it's indoors, so you don't have to worry about the weather. Um, so just come out and have a great time. We've got some prints that will be for sale as well as t-shirts uh, celebrating the event. And, um, and this is the kickoff of kickoff event for several art shows in the community um, this year. Oh, how wonderful. Why is it called the Plum Nelly Depot Art Show? <laughs> well, we have a history. There is such a place called Plum Nelly, and it's in Dade County, okay. and it's home to a lot of artists. Okay. Dade County itself is kind of an artist community. So oh. many visual artists, musicians, uh, some very well-known musicians, and, and, and well-known artists, and sculptors, and uh, all kinds of media. It, it just draws artists. So ah, this is an, it's one of several, as Sandy pointed out, the art events this year. And uh, it's, it's a good, we're going to have how many, how many artists do you reckon? Yeah, you almost, almost 50. Talk to me about the genre, like what can people expect? Because I see gourds here, that you brought in these beautiful paintings. Yes, um, several. Um, Painters. Um, this is a gourd artist, um, local. Uh, we also have um, potters and um, some sculptors, um, some metal art. Um, just you name it, we'll have it. Um, and, and this is not just Dade County artists. Um, this is area artists, so um, from Alabama, from Tennessee. Um, so it's it's going to be a wonderful day. What happens at the art show? Is it just visual art, or what what can people expect to experience? Well, we've got a couple of. Artists who are doing demonstrations. Now, the lady who did these, I think, are they earrings? Are they? Uh, <laughs> You're funny. These are rattle. This Ouch. is a rattle. Oh, um, wow. And, um, and just a gourd for, you know, for display. Um, just beautiful decorative art. I know. These are gorgeous. Like, I don't know if the camera can pick up. I don't, I'm afraid to touch it. They're beautiful gold. Can, they're very sturdy. They are. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're amazing. I love that. So, will well, there the, be music? And Go ahead. Well, the artist who does these will be doing a demonstration. Oh, and then wow. we'll have another artist who will be doing portraits. I love that. Wonderful, wonderful. Both of them are very skilled. There's, uh, what's the word? Pyrography. <laughs> the, this, the art of decorating a gourd. Yes. I love that. Yes. So the art is for sale or is it just to enjoy? No, it's for sale. Um, all artists will have, um, have their own booths and set up and so you can um, see the art, you can talk to the artist, uh, find out more about it. Um, there will be some um, entertainment. Okay. Um, actually one of the artist's husband is a wonderful entertainer so um, he'll be doing entertainment um, and then we'll have goodies from one of our local uh, cafes. Um, there for you, um, nice sweet treats and that kind of thing. So um, it'll be just a nice fun day. Why is this so important, do you think, having an art show, especially displaying art from regional artists in our community? We really want to celebrate arts in the Chattanooga area, and it's a nice opportunity for artists to come together and really have their work exposed to the public. And I would say also that our prices are moderate. Would you say that's I would a fair? Think so, yeah. and, and this is our second show. And we had, were very well attended on our first one, and people told, it, told us that they really appreciate that, that we have very affordable art, I and mean, done by very nice artists. I love hearing that Dade County is sort of a community of artists. I wonder why it's so inspirational. I mean, I, Dade County is beautiful. Why do you think people have kind of gathered there in artists? People are drawn to it, especially Lookout Mountain. Yes. And I, I don't, this, it's a wonderful question. I, I, there are a number of communities around the America where artists are drawn, and I think they're drawn to places where, first of all, affordable, where they can oh. afford cause, uh, nice studios. Right. And secondly, it's a place where they can live and have, be, be appreciated for their craft. And it's a very, go ahead. And the inspiration. I mean, right. just from you know where it's at, it's just so beautiful and you know, it inspires um, artists to, to um, you know, create. Yeah. Um, so it, it's, it's one of those things where um, um, we want to celebrate that and, um, and encourage that. And, and the, the history, right. um, we want to, to continue that. So um, yes, it's been an artist community for many, many years and, um, and we want to encourage other artists to come 
see what we what we love. I love that. I can already imagine the diverse sort of examples you will have presented because the community is so diverse. You have the you have the history of you know the Native American community here, and then African Americans and settlers. Like it, what a beautiful com combination confluence of art right here. How very exciting. And it's a really a wonderful kind of a hidden part of the Chattanooga area. Mm -hmm. We're so close. Our high school is maybe 20, what, about 21 20 miles from downtown yeah. Chattanooga. Yeah. Amazing, and it's such a beautiful area. Thank you all for coming in. So tell Thank us one more time on how we can enjoy this, how much tickets are, and all that jazz. Okay. Um, tickets are free. Uh, it is free admission. Um, you, the uh, event starts at 10 o'clock and goes to 4.30 on Saturday, um, this coming Saturday the 12th. <laughs> and um, so you can find us at the Dade County High School, which is uh, 300 Tradition Lane. Um, in Trenton, Georgia. Wonderful. We have lots of signs up. If yes. You... <laughs> Should be easy to find. I really want to explore it. So the Plumnelly Depot Art Show this Saturday, August 12th. There's the info up there on our screen. Sounds really amazing. Allianceforday.com. I guess you're CEO of the Alliance for Day Chamber of Commerce and Welcome Center. Yes. Wonderful. Thank you both so much for coming in today. And that sounds like you're very passionate about this art. And I was excited that you brought in these beautiful pieces for our viewers to see. So it's this Saturday, August 12th. Day Dade County High School, 10 to 4.30 p.m., allianceforday.com, Plumnelly Depot Art Show. Thanks again for coming on the show. Thanks, Thanks for, for having, having us. us.